and welcome back to my channel. I'm Isabel. Today we're going to be doing an H&M try on haul. So let's get started. Today's try on haul is a little bit different. I'm trying to change my style. So I went on Pinterest and I looked up some inspiration and I bought things kind of according to that inspo. So let's see how it all turned out. Be nice, please. I don't normally wear outfits like this. This is like way out of my comfort zone. My inspo for this was like skirt, top, and then like stockings like cute little stockings or like thigh high boots like that like the only thing is like i have to wear some type of stockings with this because if you look at the back like my whole ass is like almost hanging out and i can't bend down in this i've lost so much weight so like i got the top in a size large and it's like already loose but i would probably wear it more like i would i would try to do it like a little crop you know but i wonder if i could like like I could probably tighten this, like bring it in a little bit, because it's so loose. So it's from H&M, but it's really comfortable, like, I, <laughs> and I think it's so cute. I'm also going to show you, so this is outfit one, but I'm going to show you what I would wear with the skirt, because I'm not, like, the, the matching set is cute, but I probably wouldn't wear it every single time. So I'll show you some ideas that I have of things that are already in my closet. This is outfit number one. Show you back. Like I feel like a princess, I could twirl around. <laughs> so this is like outfit number two with the same skirt. So like I already have this top and this top actually just happens to be from H&M too. But like I think it's cute, like the two browns and then imagine with some brown thigh high boots. A lot of my outfits that I've tried on for you guys is, is more for the male gaze. Like this is more for like me. like. Things that I think are cute. I don't know. It's classy. It's cute. I can see myself like going out and meeting a rich sugar daddy like with this. Like I don't know. Obviously with some stockings though. It's not like I said. It's not normally my style. But the thing is, is that I don't have a style. I just wear what I wear all the time. Is like sweatpants and a shirt. Like I don't normally. I don't really show out. You know. Like I. I want to like start actually dressing and like looking good and feeling good i just i'm tired of like constantly just wearing like athleisure or just like uh leggings and a shirt or jeans and a black t-shirt like i want to actually like i want to actually wear clothes that i feel really pretty in and like this is one of them it's so cute and what i could do is i could wear like a gold chain or maybe some rings i think what i'm gonna do too i think we're gonna go pierce our ears i would go today but it's the weekend of black friday and uh i don't feel like being trampled over to go to claire's okay and then i have one more shirt with this skirt that i want to show you this is my third option with the skirt i honestly don't think i like it as much but the thing is, is that I feel like it's a good concept. It's just maybe not with a silk shirt, maybe more with like one of those bodycon regular cotton ones and then it would look really good. And I think this is also too big, which it never used to be, so yay me. But like, I don't know. I feel like it could work, just not with this specific button down. You know what I mean? It's like kind of like the last option that I had with this skirt. I feel like you could also just wear like a cute little black crop top or like, I don't know, I feel like the skirt it can match with pretty much everything because it's brown, but I love the skirt itself. I think it's cute. I, I can just imagine I can probably wear it a couple times and then just with some thigh highs and like some cute jewelry. You guys have no idea the hell that I just went through to put on this skirt. I even have it on backwards because my roommate's not home right now and I really wanted to show you guys the skirt. It's a little too tight on me, but it won't be for long. I think it's cute. It's like, a, it's like a cute little pencil skirt and it's backwards, so, you know. But this is like the concept. I think it's cute. Obviously, like, I feel like I need to lose a little bit more weight to fit into it or get a bigger size, but, like, it's cute. It's more of a professional vibe, I would say, than the other one. The other one's more for, like, fun. This is more for, like, I, I'm going to a work conference, I guess. Like, it's more professional, I think to the point i'm trying to i'm turning 26 soon i feel like i need to start acting like an adult and dressing like one and one outfit option i am going to show you guys a couple of different shirts that i think would also look cute with this skirt the material is not the most comfortable but again it's it's a little tight on me so that's probably why but 
I'm sure like one size shrink down a little bit. For anyone curious, the skirt is a size 10. Uh, the other skirt was actually a size large. It was weird, like this is numbered, that's small, medium, large, whatever. This is a 10. This top is also from H&M, it's a large. This is another option. Again, I feel like it would be better without the silk shirt. I think that if this was like a cotton, you know, and this one's like a little, like these are all old and they're like too big. But once this skirt fits me a little better, it's going to be really cute. It looks better in my head. That's the sad part. I just want to start looking more professional. I, I can't even explain the, the want for it, but I'm really big on manifesting. And I think that if you want a specific type of lifestyle, you have to dress like you already have it. And you have to act like you already have it. Fake it till you make it. And I think that for a long time, I just kind of dressed like normal. I didn't really put any effort into my appearance. Like I am wearing athleisure is fine if you're going to the gym, but even if I'm just going to the store, I should be dressing a little bit more professional. Professional attire leads to professional experiences. Low effort appearance leads to low effort experiences and high effort appearance leads to high effort appearances. That's just my belief, that's how I, how I view things. And yeah, so we're changing it up. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the new style that I'm going for, let me know down in the comments below. If you know of any other brands or anything else that you think I should try on, comment it down below too. But I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week.